Hello everyone, welcome to study time. In this video, we are going to see class 3 computer, KV or CBSE syllabus. Previously, there is a video for introduction about MS Word. This is more about MS Word. These are the topics I am going to cover. So, toolbar, font attributes, then change cases insert menu options we will be seeing in this video next formatting text what is meant by formatting text it includes font change font size underline style bold italic etc first type the text then select the portion of the text using any selection and procedure you can select by using mouse or using uh, keys then Change the font style, font size, grow font or shrink font of the text. Next, bold, italic and underline option. First, type the text. On the top, I have uh, circled with red as it. You can choose any of those options. First one is B means bold. I means italic. U means underline. So, whichever option you want, you can choose that one. Next, superscript and subscript. Subscript. What is superscript means? There are uh, places where you will need the text to be displayed on the top, like x square. If you want to write um, formula for water, H2O, here that is subscript. So in these places, you need superscript or subscript. So, see, I have circled with red desert that is superscript and subscript options next creating bulleted and numbered list so if it is a paragraph you know need uh, this bulleting and numbering options if you want to list anything either you will be listing like one two three or roman letters or a b c or just a dot arrow mark tick whatever options you want you can use in this next alignment of text what is alignment alignment means um, the text can be aligned in the center of a page left right or along both left and right margins so uh, these are the options that you can use first one is left second one is center third one is right fourth one is justify justify means for for both left and right uh, alignment we'll use justify see here i have given the example of text first one is left alignment so left side it is aligned second picture is center alignment where the text is aligned along the center next here it is right alignment so the text will be aligned right side justify alignment means where you can uh, have both right and left justified change case so these are the change case options first one is sentence case lower case upper case capitalize each word toggle case sentence case means as you see in the text first one will be capital Lower case means all the letter will be in the lower case. Upper case means all the letter will be in upper case. Capitalize each word means each word of the text will be capitalized. Then toggle case means first letter will be small, others will be capital. See, for here it is an example for center, sentence case, lower, lower case, upper case, capitalize each word. Next, inserting the special characters and symbols. You cannot type special characters where you can insert. So, see the file menu. There you have insert options. The last one, you can see symbol. If you click on the symbol, all the symbols will be displayed. After which you can select any of the symbol next insert word art so 
the same uh, insert option you will see word art so a is displayed now that is word art so if you click on the word art you want after which if you type the word art will be used next pa page break you cannot continuously type uh, paragraph so if you want to take a print you need some page break this page break uh, you can use using control written or page break option in the toolbars next clip art using this clip art you can insert a picture photo album images this is the clip art pane already there are uh, there there will be some predefined images you can click on those and use next inserting shape the same in under insert bar you will be having shapes you can see arrow marks uh, basic shapes all those thing you will be seeing under shapes next in uh, text box insertion so you can have a text box to be inserted so these are the options available simple text box alphabet code alphabet sidebar annual code annual slide bar these are the options available under text box next page number insertion after having the page break you need some page number so here it is page number under insert tool so you can have uh, the page number either on the top of page or bottom of page you can have page margins all those things you can do under page number next date time insertion you can also insert date time so under insert bar there is an option i have uh, marked in red so that is the option for date and time the drop down will appear like this you can choose the date time format either it is fully numbered or day month date and year you can choose a format you want next short answers how do we select the line word and letter in ms word select the text by pressing shift and mouse click or shift plus arrow key how can we make our whole document in upper case press control a or select the whole document using mouse and select change case option in font box then select upper case option list some special characters used in ms word dollar percentage hash star these are the special characters which button would you press to align the text on both left and right margins already i have told no you have to use a justify under paragraph box what is the purpose of page break to have a break in between the pages this can be achieved by using control enter next write the missing letters so you can expect these kind of questions in computer so just uh, have a look at these spellings character clip art alignment italics paragraph word art so please know note down the spellings of these uh, special words so that you can write these kind of questions identify the following buttons i have given the answer directly first one is right alignment sorry first one is left alignment second one is right alignment third one is um, justify fourth one is change case then word art lab session create a new document write few of your choice use bold italic underline for headings so this is the, here the heading is internet i have made uh, that uh, internet as bold italic and underline if there is any doubt please post in comment